Imagine spawning onto a deserted island with limited resources, where you think everything is normal, but there's natural disasters randomly. And when nighttime hits, you hear screams in the distance. And then all of a sudden, you're being chased by every horror creature. Well, today I try to survive on this cursed island in hard mode, with multiple creatures always out for me. Will I be able to survive from the dwellers and natural disasters? Let's find out. And here we are. So this is the spawn. We have got two jungle trees. Right, so this first island has lots of different mods. We've got lots of different dwellers in the game. The man, the fog, cave dweller, goat man, mimic one as well. There's lots of different ones. There's more than that. There is also natural disasters. So tornadoes, acid storms. As you can see, the island is surrounded by octopus and great white sharks everywhere. Everything's pretty chill and normal now, but when it gets to night time, that's when it starts to become a nuisance. Oh, we have some sheep. We have tree sheep. Okay, let's start getting some seeds because that is going to be essential. Okay, I gotta remember that I have a week here. The blood moon is rising. Are you taking the piss? So there is a very low chance that a blood moon can spawn. Basically what that is, it spawns all the different mobs in the game. Actually, let's try and get some cobblestone. What was that sound? A lightning storm already. I'm already getting hit by lightning. I need to get underneath something. Woo! What the fuck? The only thing I spawn with, by the way, is just a flashlight. So this is uh, a modded flashlight that can help getting rid of the dwellers. I should have just stayed underground. Luckily, we haven't seen a dweller yet, though. So in the Blood Moon, these creatures have double speed, double damage. So if I go down there and go on the grass, they're just going to run directly at me and just kill me instantly. So there's no point in me leaving my little, my little cubby hole up here. What the fuck? I can mine the wood in this tree. Do you feel what she should? I see her eyeballs there. But I will not be looking at that. Oh, the eyes are still there. Nighttime is starting to go away. So my plan for day two. Day one was absolutely dreadful and did absolutely nothing. There's nothing I can do. The plan for day two is to get these sheep breeding get some food that would whoa oh hello go away the flashlight seem to work there's a lot of sheep here so i'm gonna get myself a bed into your new home Surprise, um fucking siren head we have to be quiet oh why is he coming my way is he gone? He's gone. Okay. Oh. Surprise, Shawty! When did you get here? Did you just respawn? I'm trying to actually get some progress done, Siren Head, so if you can... Piss... Off... Can I build my house? No, I cannot. I can't even see him. I'm just gonna build my house, and everything's gonna be okay. Ooh. Whoa. Hi, how are you? Oh, hello. I'd say you're pretty chill. I'd say if I just don't look at you. Ooh. Ooh. What the fuck? Thanks for that jump scare. What? What do you mean? Oh my god, just let me build my house. Siren head as well? What am I supposed to do? I have Siren Head, this fucking lanky cunt, on my right. I have a skeleton that's gonna start shooting at me, isn't he? Oh. You have to be taking the piss. Get me out of here. No, I'm just not gonna deal with it. Fuck you. Fuck you. I don't care. I don't care. I've, I've dropped my controller, I don't care. Nope. Five minutes later. Am I okay? Yeah. Yeah, we're okay. Let's continue with the house. I'm due another monster dweller something to spawn in. What happened? Where is all the grass gone? What the fuck did I miss? Was this siren head stomping around? Okay, this is how the house is looking now. We're gonna use some burnt wood for the decor. Actually kind of fits the vibe of just the dread of this mod.
The goal obviously is to beat the Ender Dragon in the end, but that is going to be a very hard task if I can literally not even exist for longer than like five minutes. Ironically though, we're actually doing pretty good right now. Nothing's come out to kill us yet. The sun's still pretty high up, you know. No, it's not going to be... No! 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 Stop! 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 Come over to me! Come over to me! Come over to me! Yes! Follow me! Follow me! No! 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 Don't! No! Please! 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 Don't break my house up! Tornado, do not ruin everything I've worked so hard for. You can pick up the flamingos. I don't really care about the flamingos right now. I feel like I'm getting very close to that and I do not want to go on tornado right now. Oh, don't kill my sheep though. That's not cool. That's not cool. That's not cool. Blood Moon is rising. You just have to be taking the piss. There's a rainbow right now. That is not... That is not life right now. Life is not fucking rainbows. There's a Blood Moon coming. Ooh! What was that? There was no need for that. <laughs> there was no need for that. I just did a little dance on my fucking seat. I need to hurry up. I need to hurry up. Stop joking around. You know what? Fuck it. We're just gonna build our house in the night. Don't try and do a trick shot on me. Get out of my house. Okay. What was that? Why is there a spider in my house? Oh, it's the sheep man. Hello. Whoa. Fucking goat man. I swear to God. Okay, just don't look in that general direction where the goat man is. I'm, I'm sure we'll be okay. We'll work on this part of the house, okay? You fucking... I didn't look at it. Bring me that pass! <laughs> go away, go away, go away, go away, go away. Whoa, he's fucking jumping around. He can jump up blocks. That's not good to know. I don't like that. And Siren Head's here. You're not gonna shoot me? Alright, we can chill. Hello, Siren Head. Ooh, I thought we were chilling. Oh, please, daytime. Seeing daytime is like just watching heaven come down. Okay, he's dead. Okay, we got a bow and arrow. He got a tiny bit of gear. What is your obsession? Siren Head has spawned the most out of everything. And it is one of the most annoying ones. You're not even that scary. Like, just leave me alone, man. Whoa. Yeah, I know you're there, mate. You have to fucking let the whole world know. I think we're okay. Can I continue at my house now, please? Don't, no, an earthquake, an, a fucking earthquake. Don't, 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 don't ruin my house. Please don't ruin my house. There's a few holes over there. Siren head, can you? Ooh! 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 Leave me alone. Can you despawn? I hope you don't latch much longer, you absolute nuisance. The walls are nearly done in my house. There's a skeleton in my house. What? Is that goat man? Oh. Siren Head has been here for like 10 minutes now. <laughs> Who do you think you are? Who do you think you are, creeper? This guy's AI is crazy. Bro, Siren Head. Give it a rest, man. Oh. Goatman's back. Siren Head is just constantly here. Hi, how are you? What the fuck is that? What is... What? I, can, I might be able to make a run for it. He's on this side of the thingy now. Oh, he can still hear me all the way over here. I'm out of food. I can't go back to my house. Siren Head is just surrounding. I'm literally in the corner of the island. Basically, what's happened is I have been waiting here for the sun to come out. And it's finally here. I don't know what I missed, but why is there so many slime right now? There's a bearded dragon right there. Right. <laughs> it's honestly just not even funny at this point. Oh, he's right over there. Now he's attacking me. You're not getting up here. <gasps> he most definitely got up there. He can jump up tree blocks. 
Goatman is literally broken. What the fuck? I don't really like the door. The door is bugging me. This is it from the outside, guys. This needs a lot of work over here. Boom. This is the house, guys. What is the actual ops on this? It's just for me to play some blocks. Uh, obviously, I need to get some windows going. Hello, Siren Head. How are you? It is too late now. So you literally just killed my sheep for no reason. Not so scary. I enjoyed my last can of beans. Did you? We've got a bed. We're not allowed to sleep through the night. So that's one of the rules I've made. So we can put spikes around our base, which would actually really help. And that is pretty much everything. We have two jungle saplings. This is going to be the mine over here. I'm actually very curious. What happens if I'm too loud? Well, without warning me, like, do not do this right now. My trees. Whoa. What's that for? What is that noise? Who's laughing? Oh, fuck off. I'm gonna stay in my house, and I should be okay. Oh, hello. Hello. Go on, do it. I don't care anymore, Siren Head. Fuck you. Um. Um. Why is there TNT? This. No. 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 Oh. What the fuck? Get out. No. I should not have fucking done that. What? Oh my, it's Amanda Fox, stop. Um, Siren Head there, you just fucking sent meteorites down to my house. I don't like this, stop. He's just... Okay, man. Is it safe outside? No, it's not. What the fuck? How's he hitting me? <laughs> How? Wait, so I cannot alert Siren Head at all. I was inside my house and it just did not matter. <sighs> Guys, I have just literally lost everything. Oh my god, stop. <laughs> There's a blood moon rising. I'm ending the episode here. If you enjoyed, like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one.